It's a mid mic daily bite. 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 Welcome to Mid Mike Daily Bite. Chamber, did you hear about the latest in school lunch technology? Kids might be paying with Bitcoin sooner than we think. Listen, Bunch, if they can figure out how to make those rectangle pizzas taste good, I'm pretty sure they can handle crypto. But seriously, Bitcoin for lunch? I know it sounds wild, but hear me out. Cryptocurrency, especially Bitcoin, is being considered for everyday transactions. Imagine little Timmy buying his tater tots with Satoshis. You've got to be kidding me. What's next? NFTs for homework assignments? Sorry, teacher. I can't turn in my math. It's still minting on the blockchain. Actually, Chamber, it's not that far-fetched. The younger generation is already familiar with digital currencies in gaming. It's a small leap to real-world applications. Wait, hold up. Are you telling me that little Billy's Robux addiction might actually be preparing him for the future of finance? Exactly. And it's not just Bitcoin. Stable coins, which are tied to traditional assets, could be a more practical solution for daily use. They're less volatile, making them perfect for lunch money. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stable coins? Are we talking about some kind of crypto equestrian hybrid here? No, no, Chamber. Stable coins are cryptocurrencies designed to maintain a stable value, often pegged to a traditional currency like the US dollar. They're the sensible shoes of the crypto world. Ah, uh, got it. Uh, so we're talking about the minivan of digital currencies. Safe, reliable, but probably not going to impress the cool kids at the crypto cafeteria table. Speaking of the crypto cafeteria, let's dive into our new segment, Future Finance Forecast. How do you think common financial tasks might change with widespread crypto adoption? Oh, I can see it now. Instead of piggy banks, kids will have digital wallets. Tooth fairy payments, straight to the blockchain allowance, smart contracts, baby. And imagine parent-teacher conferences. Your child's grades are dropping, but their crypto portfolio is through the roof. And don't forget school fundraisers. No more selling wrapping paper. It'll be all about mining rigs in the computer lab. Support our school. Validate some transactions. You know, Chamber, all this talk about future finance is making me think about our own school days. Remember trying to scrape together enough change for a slice of pizza? Oh man, don't remind me. Um, I once tried to barter with a Yu-Gi-Oh card for some tater tots. Spoiler alert, it didn't work. But hey, maybe I was just ahead of my time. Speaking of being ahead of time, the integration of cryptocurrency into everyday life would require significant technological and regulatory changes. It's not just about the money. Hold up, Bunch. Are you telling me we need to update more than just the lunch menu? This is starting to sound like a lot of work uh, for a digital tater tot. Exactly, Chamber. We're talking about revamping entire systems, but the potential benefits are huge. Imagine instant secure transactions and financial inclusion for unbanked populations. I'm floored. So we're not just changing how kids buy lunch. Uh, we're potentially revolutionizing global finance. It is cool, but it also makes me think about what we've discussed before, the impact of AI and now crypto on our children's future. How do we prepare them for this brave new world? Good point. From early human evolution to the crypto revolution, we've come a long way, but education is key. We need to teach kids about these technologies from an early age. Speaking of education, Chamber, put on your principal hat. We're diving into the Crypto Cafeteria Challenge. I'll be the IT admin. You're the skeptical principal. Ready? Ready as I'll ever be, Bunch. Let's see how deep this rabbit hole goes. Just promise me we won't have to eat any actual cafeteria food. Principal Chamber, imagine this. No more lost lunch money. No more IOUs. Just sleek, secure Bitcoin transactions for every tater tot and milk carton. Fascinating, Mr. Bunchu. But how do you expect little Timmy to remember his 64-character private key when he can't even remember to zip up his backpack? Easy. We'll implement a biometric system. One finger scan, and boom, lunch is paid for. Ah, uh, yes, because nothing says elementary school like fingerprint databases. What's next? Retinal scans for recess? All right, all right. Maybe we start smaller. Uh, Bitcoin vending machines, but... Uh... Seriously, Chamber, I think we've stumbled onto something here. Bitcoin lunch payments might be closer than we think. Agreed. Though I must admit, the idea of a first-grade crypto tycoon is oddly appealing. 
Wolf of Sesame Street, anyone? And on that note, we'll wrap up today's mid mic Daily Bite. Remember, folks, the future of finance might be closer than you think, and it might start in the school cafeteria. Just don't try to explain Bitcoin to the lunch lady. Until next time, keep your crypto hot and your takes even hotter. It's the mid mic Daily Bite. It's the mid mic Daily Bite. It's the mid mic Daily Bite. It's the mid mic Daily Bite.